I'm attorney Martin Nicholson from the law office of Martin Nicholson. And today I'm going to talk about probable cause affidavits in Indiana, what you need to know. If you've been charged with a crime in Indiana, you may have come across the term probable cause affidavit. But what is a probable cause affidavit? In this video, I'll explain what a probable cause affidavit is and how it can impact your case. In Indiana, a probable cause affidavit is a document that is filed by the state to provide notice to the court of the charges against you. The affidavit must be based on sworn testimony or an oath, and it must set forth the facts that establish probable cause in your arrest. If the state files a probable cause affidavit in your case, it does not mean that you have been convicted of a crime. Rather, it means the state has presented evidence to the court that suggests that you have committed a crime. The court will then decide whether there is enough evidence to proceed with your case. Now, if you've been charged with a crime in Indiana, it is important to seek an advice, seek the advice of an experienced criminal defense attorney who can review the probable cause affidavit and help you understand your options. Now, I mentioned this because of the Delphi case here in Indiana. Basically, in Delphi, Indiana, Richard Allen is accused of killing Libby German and Abby Williams back in 2017. He's finally been charged with this crime, someone, and the original judge on the case sealed the probable cause affidavit so the public doesn't know what he's being charged with or what the allegations are other than murder. Normally this is made publicly. They're reading the charges. All this is given to the media, given to defense attorneys. Everybody knows, hey, here's the charging information. Here's a probable cause about what they say happened. In this particular case, the prosecutors or the police have said we want to continue the investigation and kind of find out what's going on with maybe some other people involved. Although, since they have charged him with the crime, you would think that they would know uh, their investigation would be complete in regards to Richard Allen, but apparently it's not. There was a hearing yesterday, and now what's left is for the judge to decide on whether or not she is going to release this probable cause affidavit to the public, redact part of it. Who knows what they're going to do, but normally the probable cause affidavit is something that is a public document. It's not really a secret because this is not communist China or you know Russia where they have all these secret courts and people don't know what's going on in cases. Our courts are public and they should remain that way. Here in Indianapolis, as people know, there's unfortunately murders almost happening every day, and those probable causes affidavits are made public all the time. Mm -hmm. So in this case, hopefully the judge releases it so people can know for themselves what actually the police are saying, are saying happened instead of speculation.